Welcome back. We're here at the New London Historical Society, right in New London, New Hampshire. Joining me now is Caitlin Covell. She is on the board with the Center for the Arts. Welcome. Thank you. Thanks Thank for you. Us. So happy to be here. There's so much going on this summer, starting with uh, June 27th. Yes. Arts on the Green. Yep. The Arts on the Green, the Center for the Arts. We're hosting our fourth annual Arts on the Green this year in conjunction with um, the Strawberry Festival here in New London. So we're really excited about that. That partnership is going to be really nice for the town. We have 30 juried artists this year, wow. stemming from all over New England. Um, really, not just New Hampshire. Yeah, all Wonderful. over New England. So they're bringing with them a, you know, a breath of fresh talent to the area, which is going to be really nice. In all different mediums of expressive arts, mm -hmm. um, from pastels to oil paintings, woodworking, scarves, silk scarves, which I'm really excited That's about. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. Wonderful. Yeah. Um, so. You know, can you name some of the artists that will be here? Um, a few. Um, Tatiana, we are actually um, raffling off one of her pieces in our raffle. Um, she's having original painting raffled off, as well as um, two other artists who are having some prints. Um, but the full listing you can find uh, all over the area um, in our little brochures um, as well as our posters. That's wonderful. Yeah. Well, I think this is a good opportunity to take a look at some art, buy some art. We were talking off camera. Start yeah. your art collection. Yeah, That's exactly. Good idea. It is. And it's a really good idea because of the raffle. If you, know, if you don't have a whole bunch of money that you can go out and spend mm -hmm. on a very nice piece of work, you can get a nice print to start your collection. Or if you're a longtime collector and you have those funds, you can certainly purchase just something really nice. Right, and gifts, like you Absolutely. said, the scarves, yes. you know, and the nice smaller things. Yeah, nice for, for summer birthdays gift giving. or early Christmas shopping or something mm -hmm. like and that. And hostess gifts. There's a lot of parties that go on over the summer. Yeah. What a nice Absolutely. thing to bring so as, a, as a nice handmade yeah. gift. Yeah. Um, it's an all-day affair. It's from 10 to 4, so you yes. can stay all day. Yes, you can. Um, they're going to be having, um, you know, gazebo um, artists playing on the gazebo, and there's going to be um, crafts for the kids, like face painting, mm -hmm. and of course, course strawberry shortcake eating so yes you can come and stay all day from 10 to 4. That's super. It sounds like an awesome day for everybody. Um, let's talk a little bit about the Center for the Arts because you are a wonderful organization and you are a clearinghouse for all the arts in the area. Isn't that yes, right? Yes, yes, we are. Yeah, we're a nonprofit um, based here out of the Sunapee region. We have um, a few micro galleries here in New London at the Lake Sunapee Bank on Main Street, um, Zero Celsius Wealth Management, the New London Inn, and we also have a members gallery at Whipple Hall in New London. Mm -hmm. um, every first Friday of the month, we host um, free and open to the public receptions. Um, you know, with a vast array of different things to go to from plays, um, micro gallery openings, poetry readings, and all sorts of talents. So it's a really nice thing for you to do if you don't have anything planned for a Friday night. Absolutely. Yeah. Well, there's always something going on. I think one of the best ways to stay in to keep it informed is to sign up for your newsletter Absolutely. because that comes out and then you just can look through it and say yep. that's what I'm doing. Yep, and you can do that through our website. Um, we also throughout the area have our um, brochures mm -hmm. especially located in our micro galleries so you can always stop into one of those locations and pick them up or talk with someone and find out more about us. Mm -hmm. yeah. You're a great supporter of the arts and recently you just received a statewide award. Talk a little bit about that. Yeah, we did. Um, at our New London Main Street um, Lake Sun FB Bank micro gallery. Um, they have been a micro gallery for about a year. I actually managed that office as well. And the Center for the Arts nominated that branch and the bank as a whole for a Business in the Arts Award. Nice. Um, and out of about 60 different um, businesses, Lake Sun Epi Bank ended up winning through the Center for the Arts nomination um, the award for the medium business, the medium sized business. So that was awesome. really exciting. And that took place back um, in May in Manchester. Oh, that's so, yeah. great. Congratulations. Thank that's you. That's wonderful. Thank nice you. to be rewarded for all your yeah, efforts. Yeah, and, and it's nice to see, um, you know, the relationships between the business world and the arts world, you know, and how they can Absolutely. come together. Mm -hmm. um, so it's, it's a great really marriage. Exciting. Mm -hmm. yeah. You've really helped make that happen. Well, thanks so much. June 27th is the date. Yeah. Um, arts on the Green. 10 to 4. Something not to miss. 10 to 4. All kinds of great activities yes. for everybody. Well, very good. Thanks. Thank Best you. wishes. Thank you for having me. Take care.